Jackson Day! Hinga dinga dargan! <laughs> Holy sh! Zeke. Bad man with the five gifted. Oh, Daddy dude. Warbuck General over here. What a dude. I don't even remember what we were doing, Joe. We just completed the first gym battle. Oh, that's true. I have we got Ross the first off. badge yeah. under our belt, and that's where he departed for today. But now we are back. Just to remind everyone of the rules if a Pokemon faints, they die. If gone we fail forever. to catch a Pokemon on a route, that route is gone. And every Pokemon has to have a nickname to be used so we have form uh, emotional attachment with these beautiful boys before they die and we have to bury them if they faint they are gone okay. reduced to atoms and the biggest thing is say if my first pokemans hits the gutter goes into the forever graveyard box so does dixon's connecting pokemon hence the name soul lock bounded yes, sir. by the very being that is the pokemon that sounds rough i'm not gonna lie it's Pretty a great much. time because you got to work together to win sometimes. AKA Joe's going to say, hey, what does this guy know? Basically, hey, every fight I get into, please tell me what to do so I am not emotionally distressed. <laughs> Where did we leave off? Did we have a game plan? I feel like we didn't have a game plan because we like... No game plan, but there's two more encounters we can do, Joe. Yo, I got f***ing money, dude. Yeah, you beat up a gym leader. You, you pretty much just beat up the mayor. <laughs> I'm like, this is my town. Get out of here. I own these streets, baby. Just so wait till your I first have... Pokemon dies. So here's the thing, Joe. If you go to the left of the city and down there's a place called the ruins of alf you'll run into this big like architecture site this is an encounter area where we can catch pokemon but there's multiple ways to catch pokemon here so you can tell me what you want to do i feel 36. like i feel like we should catch them in the same sort of method like if i fish on a route you should fish on a route you know what i mean okay yeah i'm down for that i feel like that makes oh a scope left hold on i'm just getting my water jug with the proper attachments because content warning is put a little bit of strain and I'm gonna be talking for I don't even know how long. Yes, sir. What does a scope lens do? What did I find? I think it's a critical hit chance item. Yeah. So now, <clears throat> is this one of those areas where we have to, we might be potentially fishing on the same route? We don't have a fishing rod yet, so no. Right. But we can catch Pokemon inside of the buildings or in potentially breaking rocks with Rock Smash. Okay, so I went down. Break... Oh, yeah, ruins. Oh, yeah, I'm here now. You, so if you see on the left, there's three Rock Smashable rocks. But that far left one, that's like the middle height one, right behind there, there's actually a hidden item. So I kind of want to get that. But the question is, do we want to do that before or after we? We catch a pokemon if we do it before that rock could contain a pokemon if it doesn't we just get the item and that's cool but we also could get pokemon from the ruins usually they're all unknowns and like you know you get whatever letter of the alphabet unknown you catch but in this case they're gonna be random i say let's do the rock smash first rock smash i like it well big gamba if it's a pokemon then the other one will so, smash some rock i've actually i don't think i've ever did this when i played back in the day like use these disc things so i don't even know how this works so i just click so on you one open your items you click on the hm rock smash and then you just click on use. use and you gotta use it on a pokemon that is able to learn it boot it up in hm teach uh yes Ooh, actually, Anybody? fruit, strawberry, and mini. Fruit is a Krogon, strawberry is a Clefable, and mini is the blue one, right? Yeah, the Azel or whatever. So here's the thing about HMs. You can't get rid of them. Once they're on a Pokemon, they're on there. But the other thing is, if you find the guy who's a move forgetter, he can get rid of them. He's the only one that can do it, but you don't find him until later in the game. So you gotta be kind of comfortable with who's uh, got it on them. I mean, honestly, it's either between strawberry or fruit. I'm I thinking, like honestly, I'm thinking fruit's really calling out to me lie. for rock smash. Oh, fruit can do it too. Yeah, ooh, you know what? Fruit's a fighting type. Give it to him. It's a stab move. So see how it's 40 power? It's actually 60 power on fruit. Ooh, yeah, fruit's definitely going to get it then, for sure. Also, fruit has doo-doo butts moves. But uh, HMs don't go away, so you can teach it to anybody you want. Oh, okay. That's actually dope. PMs only are around once. So you get like a hydro pump. You better pick someone that you want on Hydro Pump, and you're not afraid that if they die, you lose Hydro Pump as well. Oh, so for me, there was no Pokemon in there, which is fine. We don't need that Pokemon up here. All right. But inside I uh, got the a rock splash tube. plate. Hey, that's pretty good. That increases water type damage by, I think, 15%. So your boy, uh, Rockstar, could use that if you wanted. So then hit give Rockstar. Bingo. Sick. All right. So now we got that little encounter out of the way. Should I use Rock Smash on all these other ones, or does that not really matter? If, if you want a Pokemon as your encounter from the Ruins of Alf from a Rock Smash. That's what I was saying with, like, I want that item, but if you smash the rock and a Pokemon pops out, usually it's a Geodude. Actually, Joe, you know what? Go back towards that rock, and you see that building that's, like, got the moss on it? You can actually go through that building. It's a little hard to see, but you can go through this building on the left. Oh, shit. 
So we could smash these two rocks and get another item. Let's do it. Big moves. And if a Pokemon pops out, then... Ooh, a sticky barb. That's useful. Oh, I got a Pokemon. Ooh. What did I get? That means I gotta break rocks until I, I find I got a, a Ditto. Oh. Right, that could be... Oh. That sucks. Because Ditto doesn't have Transform, so he's just like a little... Do I straight up just have like a little fucking blobber? You might just have a blob, depending on his moves. Ditto is a normal type, so he doesn't resist any moves, and he's only weak to fighting type moves. I mean, he's a level 14, so I feel like if I... I don't... Would Dizzy Punch kill him, you think? Uh, Reggie Gigas is a god of continental strength, so it may do damage. So, who would be good to throw in against Ditto? Because, I mean, he's a, I don't know if I'm looking too much into the levels. Levels are a good thing to look at. Throw Rockstar yeah, in there, but then again, I just been, boosted his moves. I have been smashing rocks left and right. I ain't finding any Pokemons in here. <laughs> Luckily, you can just leave the area and come back and all the rocks are back. I gotta have one of these rocks be inhabited. Keep finding shards in the rubble. I got a blue shard, a green shard, a red shard. Wait, Ditto straight up just use Transform. Okay, good. He's got the moves. So now he is Strawberry. And he's got all of Strawberry's moves and abilities. So you are pretty much fighting Strawberry right now. Okay, okay well, I just use Sing. Hopefully he doesn't use it right back. Oh, he, the Ditto's asleep. Okay, so if I'm fighting Strawberry, I'm pretty sure I can use, like, Double Slap. I don't think it will do too much damage. Um, it shouldn't. I think Double Slap wakes the enemy up if you hit them with a... The oh, I finally got a Pokemon. What's it gonna be? Ooh. It's... A, oh, it's a Sfeel. Joe, you can't kill this because Sfeel's my, like, top five Pokemon. Okay, he's well, just, well... He's just a goofy little ball. Okay. I literally have a 3D printed Sfeel sitting on my desk right now. All right, so you need to Mondo help me with this fucking ditto. <laughs> All right, well, how much damage did Double Slap do or did you miss? Basically, like, nothing. So I could just keep using Double Slap to get him down pretty low. Hey, but Strawberry's got to stop fucking missing his attacks first. Yes, Strawberry is a little bit haphazard. Hey, a little trip. Oh, four slaps. Damn. Five slaps. Strawberry. Holy shit. Oh, well, okay. Oh, no. I caught my Sfeel. How much damage did it end up doing? Like, none. Had the decent amount two. Oh, a two nickname tick. for a lady Ooh. Oh no. That's Smoke screen. What does that do? Um. It lowers accuracy, doesn't it? Yeah. It's, yeah. It's, it's. Oh my god. I got scared. It used metronome on me. I was like, oh no. How many pokeballs do you have? I have six, seven if you include the premier ball. Maybe he's bougie. He wants those nice accommodations. Yeah, maybe he's a little bit bougier than the others. The spiel, she's she's nobody like you know she's not I'm a big rig she's like I'm a simple girl I I'm fine with the pokeball. Turns out, wait what? Wait yeah. a minute. This ain't Pokemon Go. It does not guarantee on three. Pokemon Go is the only game where if you see three tickets, it's a uh, it's seriously. Yep. Yeah, I remember my first time catching YouTube. It was not a uh, fast process. That's right. wild. But hey, you know what that just means? It's a pretty uh, honestly, if you put it to sleep again, Joe, you can probably catch it easily. Man, we are just both inaccurate as all hell. Oh no. No, that's okay though, because you did just give me health back, so I can t I can take a little bit of schmackin'. Now I need to think of a name for this uh, this lovely lady here. One time out of the way. I like the name. I like this name. I saw it on a. We ad. caught Ditto. Heck yeah, we're naming this feel Calypso. It's a girl name, and it's a delicious iced tea, and it's a delicious lemonade for that matter. Nothing but W's. There we go. Calypso the Sfeel and Ditto the whatever Ditto is. Does it even have a... I don't think Ditto, Ditto has a specific gender, so we can go fucking crazy yeah, with this one. Go wild. What do you name a gelatinous blob? Gelato. I was about to say something really mean. Oh. <laughs> You're probably safer gelato then. Yeah. Gelato's a good name. Gelato's <laughs> a good name. I was going to say name it Zack. <laughs> Oh, it's an adamant Dude, steel. It's an angry little steel. <laughs> you know, he deserves it because he, he already left gaming for the night. Yeah, it's true. And it's only This steel, it's a little cutie. It's got cute charm as its ability. If you hit it, it may cause infatuation. Our box is not looking good. That's all I'm saying. If, if anyone in the starting roster dies, it ain't looking good. Yeah, I think I got one. I got a Mewtwo and a fucking Ditto. You don't have a Mewtwo. Or not a Mewtwo, a Meowth. Never mind. Ignore nice. me. <laughs> Ah, yeah, not not God. <laughs> well, apparently I'm calling myself. Uh, Joey is calling Beans. What's up, Joey? What's popping, Bean? Where I no, I was dead asleep actually. You just awoke me in the middle of my slumber. Who dares awake me? Oh yeah, me? casually my rival just has a Porygon. Eh, what a loser. But apparently his Porygon too is different you from actually. a regular Porygon too. 
Is it in the top tier, Porygon 2? Well, it's like his Porygon 2. It is in the top percentages of Porygon wow. 2. Wow. Do you know what he's saying, Dixon? I think I know what he's saying. I think he's trying to brag and I think he's to trying to down. compensate for something. But I think he wants to throw down, but like he's a loser. And he doesn't just hung up on me. It. Didn't even give me a chance to even like answer. Well, he knows if you had a Porygon too, which he doesn't know if you do or don't, it'd be better than his. All right, Found Joe. So once, once you do that, Ash. oh, Sacred Ash actually, and it's a very good item in a normal playthrough. I think it revives your Pokemon fully. Bad news, Joe. Not happening here. You can just sell it, frankly, because we ain't reviving nothing. All right, so what's the plan now for this area? Uh, if you want, you can go back to the Pokemon Center and just see what ability Ditto had if you care, but you might not. Is there a Poke Center near here, or do I have to go back to the... I'm actually going to also save really quick. Good, good call, good call. It's in the town. Okay. So I'll just this to... Ruins of Alf, uh, if you go to the right, actually just connects that route you got scared of that one time. Oh, Route uh, 32 or something? Mm -hmm. They just connect. Is there a center over there I can go heal at? Well, if you go to Route 32, you just walk north into the city again. Oh, okay. But there is a nice man in a, in a dress shirt who gives you a miracle seed when you get to this route for beating the gym. And the miracle seed is nice because it gives you 15% more power from grass-type moves. I don't think I have a grass-type yet. You don't, but... You never know. I'm gonna call my mom and see how much money she's got saved up already. What a G. Five hundred sixty-two dollars? Heck yeah! When I come back home, I'm taking it all. Oh yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, I Sailor got Joey. Yourself. Wait, whoa, whoa, Sailor Joey, did you just challenge me? You coming for the title belt? Apparently. Oh, when he comes up with a good strat, let's battle. Okay, so you you know you suck. He knows he's garbage. <gasps> the National Park has a bug catching contest today. Oh, we missed the bug catching contest. Damn it. I'm just going to hang around in Route 32. I love Route 32 and regular Pokemon because Mareep is on this route. And Mareep is awesome and so is Ampharos. Big old, like, electric kangaroo sheep thing. All right, so let's see. For Ditto, its ability is Iron Fist, which boosts the power of punching moves. However, its only ability is Transform. Yeah, that's unfortunate because I'm pretty sure its ability switches when it transforms too. Ditto's an interesting Pokemon because if they have like a Dialga, you just throw Ditto out and be like, yeah, now I got a Dialga. What are you going to do about it? But is it interesting enough to keep in the roster? I don't know. I mean, it is a level 14. Yeah, that is pretty good. You got to think about it. So I wouldn't have around? to like train him up and he could always be like a last there resort kind of thing. I'd be okay bringing Calypso I think into I, the roster. I think, I think I might do that. The question is where the, oh, my Calypso is only level eight. Uh, I would trade out the, the, the Azula or whatever. Level one Azula. All yeah. right, I'll put Abra back on the bench. <gasps> That's what I should have named her Azula. So no, she's just. Mini. You bet she's water type. First so, yeah. fire type you catch that is not Slugma. Azula. There we go. All right. You know, that kind of helps my roster out because now I have a water type on the team. But you got to have the correct photo up now. Oh, that's true. I do got to update that. I mean, Steel is just such a good boy. Don't worry about it, Abra. You'll be back. You'll be back when somebody dies. I probably guarantee it. Oh, he's such a happy little dude. Oh, well, Wade was just calling me and I totally walked outside, which canceled the phone call. Sorry, Wade. Bigger fish to fry. Oh, yeah. Oh, easy. Oh, man, I just have to readjust the size. Look at that little blob. Look at that little dude. He's just a happy little dude. He's vibing. He's a little jello ball. He's just straight chilling. Who would have thought I'd have, a, I'd have Regigigas and Ditto in the same squad? Not me. Mainly because I figured Regigigas would have died by now. <laughs> All I'm saying is that is the most, like, perfect duo we could have. We got two legendaries paired together. Absolutely insanity. But not, okay, so we got a rock place. We got the Pokemon yeah. there. Do we want to get another Pokemon encounter, or should we try to, like, be do you want to beef up some of your dudes? We've already got everyone kind of up to level. Yeah, I think for mine, the lowest I got is, honestly, Fruit at level 8, Turbo's level 9, and everybody else is level 10 plus. Yeah, I got two 14s, a 13, and a 12, 11, and Calypso's level 8, so she's the lowest. I don't really care. She can just be the sandbag for now. Route 32, though, Joe, you want to go in first, or should I? I'm not there, so if you want to go there first to get that ball starter, you can. We're uh, going in. Ooh, who's gonna get chat what are we thinking what do we think he's gonna get i just walked around all these people yo is there just no pokemon in this route oh, there we go baby i'm here it's a uh, shroomish Ooh. oh no shroomish sucks what are we gonna get who's his okay. buddy 
Krumish doesn't deserve I got that. a mag buy. Hey, it's Stag. Watch WrestleMania? Heck yeah, man. WrestleMania is awesome. I would be watching it. Shoot, I should be there right now. I'm close by to where it's at, but... Bro, head on over, dude. IRL stream. Boot it up on your I phone. Don't, I don't need to pay, uh, you know, WrestleMania entrance fee. He's got I, oh, yeah, you don't have to pay for something that you own already. Okay, you said you got a Magby. Magby's kind of doo-doo. Uh, it gets better as it levels up. Bro, or why do all I mean? my Firemons be doo-doo cheeks? Well, because usually they start off weak and get real strong. Magby is Magmar and Magmar's baby part. Obviously, so water it, would do good against you, but you're level you're also, six. You also might kill him. Now, I'm not saying I I need Shroomish. Like, it should be a good practice, you know, to try to catch every Mons from every round. Oh, it's great practice. You don't want to lose a thing, because what happens when, you know, Celebi dies and now I need a grass type? Shroomish, boom. And he's grass fighting. When it evolves, it's awesome. I'm just trying to think though, because he's a level six. He's a Magby's pretty weak. Honestly, you just throw a ball at it, you'll probably catch it. At these levels, you can honestly just chuck balls at the Pokemon. I need to buy more balls though. I'm on down to four now. You should definitely do that. Just a one tick. Yeah, you might want to hit it once or twice, but this guy is weak. What do I hit him? I mean, Fruit's my That's lowest good. level. Unless maybe I take it out with Turbo. Astonished is a pretty crap move. You could probably hit him and barely do any damage. Astonished did a decent... I could, I could do Astonish again. Just and... remember, Crit in these games is double. So as long as that move, double what you did, doesn't kill him, you're fine. No, yeah. If I do get a Crit... Then you're golden. I could probably get away with a Mon Ball. Is he yellow health? Yeah. I try it once. Although... If I crit now, we're... Oh, Jesus, a one tick. Okay. Uh, we're going to bring in Strawberry, gamba. and we're going to sleep him. Big Gamba here. I just realized something, because I just saw Stag in the chat. He said he's watching WWE right now. Mm -hmm. Is that SmackDown yeah. thing different than the WWE? Or is that like the same thing? WrestleMania. Oh, WrestleMania. Right that's now. what you said. WrestleMania is the WWE's, like, main thing. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, like the main event. I think SmackDown kind of like theirs. Excellent. Super Bowl for WW. That's actually a great way to put it. That's the best way to put it. Bro, how, you're Bowl. asleep. How are you fighting me back? Dixon, this isn't good. Is it actually asleep? It's asleep. I only have two more Mon Balls. Honestly, I think you might want to hit him again with uh, your boy. Fruit. I'm just thinking you got not a ton of Pokeballs left. Oh, Ledibo is in these woods? Get out of here, Ledibo. Do they make it hard to get Pokeballs or do you like restrict a certain amount? No, I'm just um, an idiot and didn't buy more. Oh, now you yeah, fucking money. wake up, Bic? Well, money is also an issue for people like me who are bad at managing it because they spend it all. <laughs> Slash, I had to spend all- Oh, Jigs was in this route? You know what? Groomish might have been the best option. Alright, he's red now, so... There Back. you go. Do I bother to- Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna I'm sleep him. I'm gonna try to get, like, the best chance because I only have two balls left. I like it, I like it. Strawberry, we gotta work on that accuracy, buddy. I mean, Sing is not a perfect accuracy move. I'll give I'll give Strawberry some slack here. Now, A uh, Magneton, that would have been an awesome encounter. Ba -da -da -ba, ba -da -da -ba, ba 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 two, three. Dude. Magby, you think you're special, huh? This dude's a fucking fighter. You're not nothing, you Magby. You know what? I think it's because oh. he wants to be actually awake. I want this Shroomish to actually align. It has Levitate. It doesn't get hurt by ground-type moves. That's kind of nice. Oh. Uh, well, I think I just have to throw, unless I try to sleep him again. Do whatever you want, Joe. Otherwise, I'll just delete this Pokemon. Actually, I'm going to stay in the Pokemon Center. Actually, I'm going to name my Box 8's going to be called Joe's Fall. Ow! <laughs> Box 18 is going to be called Joe's Fault, such as Laundry of the Togepi. Yeah, oh, man. Oh, that's not my fault, dude. The Pokemon ran from me. Did you me. say Laundry? I named my Togepi Laundry because I had a Togekiss that I named Big Laundry one time. Okay, fair enough. Well, no, I think about it, they, I, 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 Brother, I, I I, I'm out of Pokeballs, man. Bump, bump. Joe did it is the name of the box. <sighs> Fits no. perfectly. Really, oh, Joe's fault gosh. fits fucking perfectly. No, Joe, Joe did, did it fit perfectly. <laughs> Goodbye, Mellow. Go in the Joe did it's box. We got, oh, Magby. We got I, it feels like the right thing to do would just be to let you go and, and to just, just thrive, but you've caused me so much fucking problem. I'm gonna pimp smack the fuck out of you. Agreed. Literally like five fucking Pokeballs and dude just was not having it. And Yo. this one will be called the Raveyard. Well, no Mon. 
from Route 32. I keep the thinking radiard. that's the fucking Poke Center, dude. My brain is tiny. So is Magby. I probably could have gotten so many better mods from that fucking spot, too. Oh, you better believe it. Magby is terrible. All right, well, time to start moving through Route 32 because this is the way forward. A Celio. There's both Spiel and Celio on this route. That's kind of wild, actually. Oh, wait, no. Spiel is on the last route. I'm dumb. Oh. Oh, yo, there's a Magmar on this route, Joe. I could have had your, uh, your guy. Whatever Magby's name would have been. Dude, Actually, it's a little on. bit. My, my, my brain bad. is being a special place right now. I literally went up to go buy Pokeballs and then I just went to heal my Mons and not buy Pokeballs. It sounds like me in a nutshell. Actually, wait, can I just. Oh, no. Oh, that was scary. I saw the word bide pop up and if that hit me, I would die. Rasal Ghoul takes no prisoners. Ironically. Wait, why can't I buy more than t nine Pokeballs? Because you don't have enough money. Oh, what? I want that free one. Then you could save up if you want. Can I sell like another thing? <laughs> no, but I literally do not have any more Pokeballs. Oh, Revival Herb. 1400! There you go. God damn. Joe's getting money. I'm. Oh, that's gonna hurt, isn't it? Nope, it did one damage. There we go, Calypso. Oh, it kissed you. It put him to sleep. Are you kidding me? Oh, Calypso with the one turn sleep. Doesn't care. Get out of here, Jinx, you freak. Easy level up. All right, now we got Pokeballs, and now we got more potions. Time to go into Route 32 and start beating the shit out of things. Yes, sir. Did you get the Miracle Seed from the guy? I did. 